Okay. Next. Um, we have Joseph Robinson. Right here. Yes. Joe? Which one's Joe? Hi. Okay. Well, <laughs> go ahead. I can, I can raise my voice. Yeah, raise your voice. <laughs> um, so, I, um, there's a issue that has, <laughs> there's an issue that has um, sort of been um, kind of neglected uh, recently, and that's the issue of net neutrality. Have you heard of net neutrality at all? Yeah, we, I, I have not. Uh, we had put statement out a while ago on that. There was what nothing was been before the legislature recently on it, so what was I your stance not, on that? Not changed uh, any position on it, um, and, and that's all I'm going to say for now. So what is, what is your position? Point, I have no stated position right now on it. What is your position? I just wanted to say that it's a big, it's a much bigger deal than I think a lot of people were giving you credit for. I mean, the internet runs our country. It, it, it I mean, it, it's sort of, um, it was a utility under Title II, but they redacted that. Um, it influences all our lives so much. Um, regardless of whether or not we use it directly, I mean, our businesses do, our, our hospitals do, and um, the idea of giving your internet service provider the power to slow down certain websites or block political candidates' websites or, or block your own business's website if you, want, if you want to start a business, I mean, it would, since we're, we're so supportive of, of businesses and everything in this country, and the idea of getting rid of net neutrality would just decimate business and so many things that, that Republicans stand for. So I don't know exactly why many Republicans are supporting it when it does so much damage. Okay. Or supporting cutting it. Robert Schmalz. Okay, that would be me. 